Look at my nails. Wait, what? Hello awesomeness, this is Maria and in today's video, I will be talking about my succulent haul that I got from Succulent Mura Bandung. Also in this video, I would like to give a shout out to Succulent Mura Bandung. Uh, that's an old shop that I found on Instagram and I am completely satisfied with their service. And today's haul is my third purchase from them. I have to admit that I'm completely a newbie and I know nothing about succulents and cacti. So basically, the reason why I make this video is to ask for my international friends for suggestions and also feedbacks and well, please answer some of my questions because I completely know nothing. If you saw some leaves that are broken, that's because I also ordered soil mix which is half a kilogram so I think that's the reason why some leaves are uh, broken. Maybe it got pressed down in a box or you know something like that. But usually they're okay, really. Here they are, I'm so sorry I don't have a proper place to um, display all of them. So I need your help guys. I killed most of my plants and here are the ones left and some of them are new. Uh, by new I mean I just bought it and it just arrived I think last week, uh, which is the second week of May 2018. And some of them are um, the old succulents that I had. So. Let me start with the first one. So here it is. I don't know what this is, but this is from the second uh, shipping that I had. But this one over here, I'm sure this is Moonstone. But see how I killed, well, almost. <laughs> I think it's dying, guys. So I don't know how much water it needs, but I, I, I'm quite sure that it is actually called a little bit of water phobia <laughs> i read it in the internet so i'm not really sure if that's really true or not but i have a new one here i believe this is of the same thing this is just like more new and still fresh and has so many leaves still i hope i don't kill this one and let me go back to the old ones so i have I have this bunch over here. This is a mini succulent that I don't know if I will be able to keep it alive or not. See how um, the tip of the leaves are actually yellowing. Can you see it guys? I don't know how much water it needs and I'm actually an overwater, so that's how I killed most of them. So what's new is the soil mix. It's kind of hard for me to find perlites and stuff here, so I gotta get, I don't know what you call it, but this is actually a husk and it's burnt before. Uh, in Bahasa Indonesia, we call it sekam bakar, so it's actually the husk of rice. That, it doesn't want to focus, right, whatever. <laughs> Yeah, so that thing helps it to be light, it helps the soil to be light. I hope I don't kill it that way. I mean, after I have this husk thingy, I hope I don't kill them like before. <laughs> because now I can feel that the soil is lighter. So I don't know what this one is called, but this was from my first shipping, or from my first order. Uh, I believe it was somewhere around January, I can't remember. This one from my March order. So yeah, I basically have to admit that this is my new uh, addiction. <laughs> now, this one here, I'm quite proud I don't kill this one because look at how pretty this is. I don't know what it's called. It has like... Uh, fur <laughs> or hair. <laughs> I don't know the right term to call it, but anyway, that, that 
that one is my favorite just because I don't kill it guys <laughs> this one over here I believe this is called the Mickey Mouse cactus <sighs> I've been told that cactus or cacti are the easiest to maintain but apparently I killed many of them already I'm so sorry I feel really bad right now I feel like a bad mom but if you look over here I have new babies I think oh, can you see it Wait, what happened with you okay so this over here I think it's kind of a new part that's growing see that that too over here yep I don't know what this is called either so I hope you can tell me what that is also over here I have this pretty so it came only like one so actually this one over here my student touched it and then it fell off and then she just stuck it over there just because she felt guilty <laughs> she's so cute so yeah I'll just keep it over there so yeah I'll just keep it over here and I don't know what that one is I almost killed it I believe now this is underwater uh, I'm still not sure and I'm so afraid guys tell me what you think I just changed um, the soil and this is the second day after I changed it do you think it's the right time to water the plant uh, tell me in the comment section down below because I really am clueless and this next one I also almost killed it apparently now it's still living <laughs> thank god and what I did with this one was I believe also together with this over here and that guy I think I underwatered it and then it kind of shrunk and now I think it's growing again I don't know all right, another old one is over here. This is the Hogwartia zebra plant. I'm quite sure, but if you see, there is no root. See that? And this is, I think, um, like shriveling and drying. I, I'm not even sure if it's still alive. Uh, it doesn't seem like there is water, or I don't know. So I bought new one. So this is from my May purchase. And these guys over here, uh, I'm actually afraid that I just um, underwater. See that it's shrunk and like it's lifeless almost. And this one got rotten. I don't know what to do, so I just stuck it in there. <sighs> I'm a bad mom. <laughs> This is, I think, this is jade plant, isn't it? I'm not sure. But this has been growing and also, um, I don't know what to do with it because it has uh, flying roots. Is that what you call it? Fly roots? Roots fly? <laughs> I don't know. And there's new babies over here. I'm quite happy, but now I don't know how to um, plant it or place it the soil um, I hope I didn't kill that one because I have so many by many I mean this was just like one plant and then it um, became so many of them. <laughs> and this was my I think third purchase no this is from February I don't know what that one is I usually kill the ones that look uh, almost like this so I don't know what they are and how much water they need. Uh, when I said I killed it, that was because I usually sprayed them with water. And then the middle got rotten. And that's how I killed it successfully. <laughs> no. And this is also the new ones. And look at how tall that is from here to there. And it's still growing. Do you think, guys, I should cut it anywhere in the middle and then start making a new plant? Oh, please, I'm clueless. Tell me, tell me. 
And this one here is one of my favorites because it has white fur. Isn't it cute? I hope I don't kill this one because this one apparently is like lamp. So, eh, I don't know. But this one is still new so this is still stiff i don't know how much water it needs i hope i don't kill it either and this one here i believe this is golem this is new i killed my first one from my first purchase where is it is it still here somewhere oh, it's gone oh oh, oh. no i killed it oh, don't kill that one. so here it is here it is. Ooh, it's dead. Oh my god. What have I done to you? My goodness. I'm so sorry. <sighs> how much water does it need, guys? I don't know how much. I hope I don't kill this one because I love it. It looks so cute. <sighs> you know, every time I find the plants that are dying or which is dead, I kind of feel like I want to kill myself too to die with it. What is this one? It looks funny and now I think it needs more sunlight, don't you think? Oh. And what do I do with the bottom leaves, guys? Tell me. And this one over here, I bought it because it has fur. It's hairy and I think it's cute. The reason why I bought this one was because it has fur or hair and apparently with this one it's still alive so I hope with this one I can keep it alive and this one here this is also new I don't know what that is it looks almost the same with this guy over here so I bet this one doesn't need that much water am I right oh my goodness I don't know what this is called and I don't know how much water they need so yeah these are all guys i hope you can help me this video is meant to ask for help i don't want to kill my succulents so i'm calling my international friends to comment and to give me suggestions of what i should do with these guys over here thank you so much for watching and i really appreciate your love and your comments suggestion and i'll see you again in my next one bye guys thank you so much